Hey there, my name is Dimitri from Taskade, and in this video, we're gonna dive into an amazing feature called AI Chat. AI Chat has been an absolutely amazing upgrade to the way that you can interact with different documents, files, and a lot more. So if you want to check it out, make sure to stick around for the rest of the video, and I'll show you exactly what it's all about. So first of all, if you go to any of your different projects here, inside of your Taskade workspace, and then click on create with AI. You'll notice right here that I can press a plus option right here and then press upload. Now, after pressing upload here, what I have is the ability to upload files and then extract the information using AI. So if I go to my drive and grab my resume here, I can put in just one or I can put in multiple ones. So say for example, I wanted to summarize candidates resume and grade it. Also create a list of questions for the candidate to answer in a potential interview. So then if I press the go sign, it'll essentially check out the PDF, analyze it, spit out all this information. This is accurate. I am just informing you this is exactly what's kind of put on my resume. It talks about my profile, my technical skills, my education. And I really appreciate that. The fact that it's able to find this kind of stuff so easily is awesome. So you see that it listened to me by putting in the resume summary, and then it gave me a grade. It gave some comments about it as well. Now these interview questions as well are pretty interesting because it essentially segmented my two questions into different areas. So at the top, you'll see it has the resume summary, and then it has the resume grade at the bottom that I said, and it also has interview questions. So let's possibly, I could say, continue writing if I wanted to have it continue. And I could have added it to a project, but instead what I'm gonna do first is actually show you how to go through that process again. And what you'll notice is if I go to add from media, after the first time I uploaded this, it's actually in my knowledge base. So it's in this media section here. So I can add from media, and then this time I'm actually going to upload a different resume. And then here is another resume that I'm going to upload. And now that they're both in here, what I'm gonna say is please create a comprehensive overview comparison of these two candidates for a paid search digital marketing job. Highlight the reasons to pick one candidate over the other. I press go here and you'll notice as it goes through this that it is figuring out a comparison analysis between the two of us and highlighting the decision factors that would go into it as well as additional considerations. So now after having finished all of this and getting this great structured approach, I can press create project. And then from here within the Acme Corporation project, I have a project with a relevant name called paid search digital marketing candidate comparison and then a overview of the two, which is awesome. I really like the way that this broke this down. It gave a quick summary and bullet point of each of us and also gave a nice framework for comparison as well as the decision-making factors and additional considerations that would go into it. Now, a great thing is if I grab this and drag it to the top of the section to essentially put that there, I can then press ask AI and interact with it in a similar way. So I could say generate a list of questions for this resume candidate if they were to be interviewed for a paid search marketing job. And in a very similar format, it's going to go through and create these questions just as I asked in a very simple fell swoop of drag file, put it into task aid and then ask a quick question. Now, after this finishes, I can copy it and paste it into the project or create a new project. I'm probably just gonna copy it though, paste it in here. I could make it a small heading like resume or questions for Nicholas interview. Paste it in there so that it would have its own little space right here. Now, another great way to do it is inside of this, I also could do a backslash upload. And then you'll see that we have a myriad of different integrations. So if I were to, for example, integrate with my Google Drive right here, I could then sign into my account. Then I'd press allow. And from here now, you can see that there is a very easy navigatable Google Drive. 
So I, for example, could just go into any of these areas that I need to grab that resume like before. And then once I press select and upload, I could press multiple, by the way, I can always go to add more and get more, but I just need this one. Once I press upload here, I then can go through that same process of asking it to create some interview questions. And after all of this, once again, if I go back to the Acme Corporation home section or any of these, and I press create with AI, and I use add from media, look at this list. It's all of the different media items that are uploaded within the workspace. So it's essentially a great knowledge base for you to interact with. So if you need some sort of baseline of information, or if you have obviously something like these resume comparisons that you need to do, it's very easy to access them with AI chat. You can also import CSVs and spreadsheets and have those be summarized very easily, as well as TXT files, as you can see within here, there are a multitude of different options. I'd suggest that you try out all of these amazing AI features and different ways to upload files using Taskade AI chat today. Thanks for watching. Make sure to check out the rest of our YouTube channel, like, subscribe, and make sure to stay up to date with everything that we're doing with AI today.